got this. Get, <laughs> leave me alone. It's all Hello. Guns. I'm so glad that's the first thing that people hear yeah. on this episode. <laughs> Hello. Hi, everyone. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to just sip my coffee. Mm. <laughs> It's early. It's an it's an early rivals, you know. That's right. Technically, technically it's technically it's late. Yeah, yeah, technically it's late. Wait, no, is it back or no. wait. We, we it's now forward. I lost an right, hour so of sleep. So, right. <laughs> That's all I know. In spring, I lose sleep. That's all that, that I need to keep track of. Yeah. Oh my God. Uh, I, I want you all. Go, go ahead, Tanya. No, I just realized Brian and you and you are next to each other in Zoom now, and they have literally yeah. the same background. <laughs> and it looked, if not for pillows, I would swear they were literally sitting next to each other. Right, right, right. <laughs> Secret mm-hmm. sauce. That's the illusion. <laughs> right. Gosh, I want you all to know that there was a point during pre pre stream that we were all seven of all seven of us, producer included, were quiet. Yeah, it was wild. <laughs> it was wild. We thought something was uh, wrong. <laughs> <laughs> but. Uh, we're not quiet now because we're live and it is, what episode is this? Six? Six. Six. Yeah, sure. Yeah, okay. Sure. Episode right. six of uh, Rivals of Waterdeep and we're here, we're live. We're coming to you uh, live in a uh, not studio because mm-hmm. we're all over the place now. Uh, but hey, it's us, we're here. Hello, we missed you all. Uh, happy time is weird day. Um, we're, it's a day. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. Uh, but let's kind of just go right into it. Let's introduce ourselves. You know who we are. We are the rivals of Waterdeep. We rival in Waterdeep. And let's go around and introduce ourselves, starting with, uh, you ready, Tanya? Yeah. All right, go ahead. Hey, I'm Tanya, Cypher uh, Tierver Online. I play your paladin ranger, Cleese Astorio. Both her pronouns and mine are she, her. All right, Sharif, it's your turn. Yeah. Hey, I'm Sharif. Uh, he, him, uh, we play in Shaka. He, him as well. Uh, Tiefling Celestial Warlock. Brian. Hey, uh, Brian here. Uh, he, they, I play Virgil, your sorcerer. I'm still stuck on rival being a verb. Like we rival, yeah. like that's not. Mm-hmm. Okay. Anyway, yeah. uh, Virgil's, Virgil's pronouns are he, him. Uh, hi everybody, I'm Okenio, I'm Dave Jezians. Uh my pronouns are he, him, and I'm playing Kent, our tiefling phantom rogue, whose pronouns are also he, him. And Masood. Hello, I'm Masood. I play Gazric Nomrad, our socialist, businessman, druid, who rivals from time to time. Uh, both our pronouns are he, him. <laughs> uh, Masood is cost- right. <laughs> Masood is cosplaying as Dahani today. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Actually, <laughs> probably honestly for the next three months till my next hair appointment. So we'll we'll just excellent. see what that looks like. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Uh and I am your dungeon master, Latia Jaquis. My pronouns are she her. I play Dahani, who is here, whose pronouns are also she her. And then I also play uh this rolling cast of NPCs and brains in jars who have varying pronouns. Um and that's us. All right, thank you, everybody. Have a great day. Uh, oh, no, <laughs> See you. Take care. It's been you. fantastic. Yeah. Um, after party? Where's the after, after party? Yeah. We expect it's, all it's, 500 of you to be there. The after yes, party is for the absolutely. next two hours. Yeah. yeah. The, exactly. Just yeah. party, dance party. Check out our Twitter. We're having a dance party in gifts. It's great. <laughs> Um, but no, we're going to move on to the next part of the stream, which is the ad reads, because people sponsor us for some reason, and we appreciate it. Uh, so, <laughs> Sharif, take it away. <laughs> Thanks for rivaling. Uh, now I'm going to rival with these ad reads. Uh, so let's start out with D&D Beyond, y'all. We have our char- character sheets digitized online. Digitized. I don't know why I said that. That was very weird. Um, um, and and like also, also we have access to source books. We can look up spells, can manage encounters, roll dice, see see like other people's like a dice rolls in your in your campaign. All kind of cool stuff there. Uh, check them out at dndbeyond.com. They've been supporting us since the beginning. Um, and uh, if you're listening live, we'll be giving away a legendary bundle. Um, so if you're in the chat, be on the lookout for the for the code word to enter the raffle. Must be present to win, um, and you can get some cool uh, legendary bundle and stuff from D and D Beyond. If you're not listening live, uh, meaning if you're listening to the podcast or the VOD, make sure to check us out on Sundays, 10 a.m. Pacific, 1 p.m. Eastern, at Twitch.tv/slash Rivals of Waterdeep. 
Um, our dice trays and vaults are provided by Wormwood, W-Y-R-M Wood. Uh, check them out at wormwoodgaming.com. Uh, you can use the code RIVALS for free domestic shipping as uh, Brian shows uh, his off, which looks awesome. Um, and and Latia, I, th- I, I think that's the, is a, is a, that like the cherry Ooh. Ooh. Uh, red, even though she Jeremy. is muted, but that's okay. Jeremy. Um, <laughs> hey, this is Paddock. My bad. I didn't know I was muted. Mm. Oh, Paddock. Okay, cool. All right. Uh, and we are pr- 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 proud to be sponsored by Die Hard Dice. <gasps> As, oh, look at the slow reveal from Latia. That was very dramatic. Yeah. Oh, my. <laughs> um, ch- ch- check them out at dieharddice.com and use the code Rivals for 10% off of your dice order there. Um, if you want other stuff in your house, you want some cool cups, shirts, mugs, all kind of good stuff, masks, even uh, make sure to go to Stormcrow, um, shop.stormcrow.com yeah. and use the code rivals for 15% off of your Stormcrow purchase there. Um, I think Masood's mug is no longer in circulation. No, um, it's buy, it's in it, circulation. I have to buy gone. a copy of Masood's. Oh, it's oh man. It's, someone oh. ordered it last week. Oh, someone, someone ordered got it. it. It's shipped out right now. I hope they enjoy it. They it, be good to it. Do not put it through the wash because it loses what is even the happening the right hand now? wash ability. What? But yeah, 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 it's it's really. I hope you take good care of it, Christopher. Okay. I hope what did I bring you it back do? to me eventually. What? Yeah. What? What? What do you mean? <laughs> Look, it's it's. I I think it's a beautiful thing that that Masood shares the stuff with the community. I think absolutely it's pretty Thank cool. You. I'm sh- I'm sure he was not paid handsomely for it. Uh, um, and what, uh, yeah, that was an option. <laughs> <laughs> it was an option. Uh, and uh, if you want to sound oh so silky smooth like the Rivals crew, check out Blue Microphones, crew.bluemic.com slash Rivals. Purchase made there will give us credit. Um, and, uh, you know, that's all of our setups uh, have that stuff. So um, we're also partnered with Idol Champions by Codename Entertainment. Right now we have Shaka, Salise, and Dahani in the game, which you could download on like everything imaginable. Um, and if, if you type in code, um, in the chat, um, you will get the free Electrum chest. Oh, also, um, there is a, uh, familiar named Disco, which is Brian's creation, which is in there as well. Um, and we might have some other rivals, uh, jumping in, uh, soon as well. So maybe sometime out. around early August, uh, early April, who knows? Maybe sometime around early April. Uh, who knows? Yeah. Um, and uh, also, we are also partnered with Warriors of Waterdeep. So you can type in wow gems in the chat to get free gems in game um, to uh, level up there as well. So thanks, y'all, for the ads. Oh, and Lauren, what about the Court of the Raven Queen? That's also happening, right? Or is that, uh, is that I swear? A if you don't, so if you don't promote your own darn thing, yeah. <laughs> Oh, Laura, oh, put I, it I, in the I, chat. I, I, champions, I talk about it. It's it's, it's rivalry. Oh, yeah. okay. I, I mean, I've I've been I've been. I I don't promote. Uh, okay, fine. You uh, do it at the end. I know. You're fine. You go. Come on. At the end, then we're promoting our other yeah. things. <laughs> Uh, Lauren called it sure. out, and I was like, "Lauren's got a good chat." Well, hey, <laughs> if if, if uh, Lauren said it, then I have yeah. to say it. So, um, <laughs> shout shout out to Oba Lauren. Uh, yeah, so um, Core of the Raven Queen, y'all. We we uh, we are uh, playing that campaign on Codename Entertainment site, twitch.tv slash CNE Games. Um, there's a bunch of folks, uh, Lauren included, in there. Um, so there's a, a whole bunch of like uh, characters from Idol uh, Champions are all taking on the Raven Queen and the Shadowfell. Um, Shaka is now a vampire um, and uh, is doing all kinds of cool things in there. Uh, so uh, make sure to check that out on uh, Monday evenings um, at uh, 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Eastern. So, so make sure to check that out. Most excellent. I'm really Most paranoid. Excellent. I know most excellent. Yeah, I'm really paranoid good. about <laughs> radical. <laughs> I'm really paranoid about phantom mic noises. So I've yeah. muted every time and I forget I that. Wait, phantom mic, is that, that a new character? Or we already had Leaf. <laughs> phantom mic. Oh, is this phantom phantom oh, that's good. That's good. I'm not even mad. Oh, I'm boy. just happy you said that. That's good. I love that. Oh boy. <laughs> let me let me write that down somewhere. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah the inventor of the large Michael, Phantom Mike. I know. <laughs> and the mic. I mean, they were like 
mythical burgers in a in a Mordenkainen's mansion. So that could be. Oh no, is Phantom Mike Mordenkainen? Look, <laughs> one I'm, of I'm, many wait aliases. Wait a second. Oh sense. my god, that actually does make sense because you can't spell. No, okay, okay, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. I mean, this stuff writes itself. It writes itself. Oh, let's go. Uh, Somebody later on, tell me who Morton Caden is. But thank you, thank you for. I mean, I, 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 obviously Brian and I know. Obviously, yeah, we don't obviously. Know. we just want to make sure that like, you know. Exactly like the Carabang, we get it. They're yeah. quizzing you. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody, get your whooshing apparatuses ready. Now I really don't know if it was no, it was definitely the blue mic dance party that our gift came from. Uh, Ooh, yeah. I like what Brian is doing. I like I like this. Oh, oh, let's go. Yeah. oh. oh he's low <laughs> enough. He's gonna, we're gonna warm up. You gotta warm up. Okay, right. We got we got some we got some Hadouken, we got some flamenco. I'm here for it. Yeah. All right. Previously on Rivals of Waterdeep. Whoosh, whoosh. That, that was fun. <laughs> so I had to make sure I didn't hit my camera at that point. Yes, I, my mic. <laughs> right. oh, God. Like, I have to go. My mic is literally right here, so I have to go like around. The mic. Yeah. <laughs> We've we whoosh responsibly. Let's be real. We try to. Hashtag always whoosh responsibly. That's right. Always whoosh with a license. Make sure you have a whoosh license. <laughs> license, license. license to whoosh. License to whoosh. License to whoosh. <laughs> Not like a a whoosh without license. A with, oh no, no. Uh, but yeah. So stuff happened last week. Please yes. explain. <laughs> well, I, we can tell you what happened. I don't know if we can explain any of it, but we'll try. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Uh, we start well. We started coming uh, back to the manor. I believe that's where yes, last week started, uh, mm-hmm. and realizing that Dahani had not in fact come home uh, the night before after her visit to the castle enters, which of course means we are immediately at DefCon twelve uh, because if someone doesn't spend the night in the manor, that means they've obviously been kidnapped by uh, a long time. Uh, rival Enemy of from rivals. many seasons ago, yeah. <laughs> to be replaced with a doppelganger, you know, we understand. Exactly right. Yeah, yeah, exactly right. So we, um, well, depending on who you ask, uh, aggressively or otherwise, stormed the Castle Enter compound. Uh, <laughs> we stormed the compound. Oh, <laughs> it was like half of us were there for breakfast, and the other half of us were there for violence, and it was. Great. I um, just don't like the imagery of storming any building. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to be associated with that. <laughs> yeah. So, I don't think we'd be very good at it anyway. Um, we found out that Tahani was, in fact, fine at the Castle Enters. Uh, she was there late working, I think, working with Baldo, right? Um, well, it, it was, yeah, like the, she was working late with both Hylock and, and Baldo Waldo. And then they were like, we'll just stay and then, like, you'll have breakfast and then you'll go home. That's what it was, but we're much too nervous for that to have gone unchecked. Uh, so it was fine. We did manage to get his name starts with an H, I think. Highlock. Highlock to um, agree under only moderate duress to assist us in our uh, restructuring of the North Ward, which was great. Also, was I the only one who saw the tension between Highlock and Solis? Was that was I the only one seeing it? Or is that uh, no, was, was there, I, no. there tension? Was there it tension? felt like tension. Yeah, it felt like, like tension. Know. It might have been it just murders. Like there might be a little maybe cast lantern history there. I'm not sure. Um, okay. you know, catch up on your rivals archives to find out what that's about. <laughs> oh, is that what that is? Okay. <laughs> From there, I can keep talking or someone can pick it up. We, we, just like listen, we just like listening to you. Yeah, all right, yeah. all right. Fine. So from yeah. there, Tell from the voice. Castle Enters, uh, where Dahani recap. was like, no, really, I'm a big bird. I can take care of myself. Uh, and we were like, fair enough, but Gazrup was gone. We went to see Zephyr at the House of Something Hands, whatever the Temple of, Den- of uh, Gond is called. Temple of Gond. Temple Gond. Temple Gond. Inspired Hands. Inspired, Inspired Hands, Ooh. that's it. Uh, we went and saw Zephyr and made a similar, if less duress-inducing speech (laughs) about our desire to, um, this one was specifically because we came up with a plan to support local like artists and artisans as part of our Revivify the North Ward campaign, which is definitely what it's called now. Um, (laughs) 
And Zafir recommended, was like, yeah, I'll see what I can do. But they recommended that we also go check any uh, temples or artisan guild halls, that sort of thing in the Northward, uh, since the two places that we went to seek assistance for the Northward were in fact not in the Northward. Uh, <laughs> what else? After we talked to Zafir, I think that was it. I think yeah, that was it. Yeah, right? was like, yeah, I, think was yeah. it. I think we ended there. Yeah, because yep. we spent a long time at the very tops, like sussing out exactly the specifics of our plan at the Yawning Portal before we yes. went home that night. So where uh, Shaka was very great at having small talk with people. He, the best. So true. great. The be- like, the best he was almost it. he was almost better at the small talk than he was at the carnival. Like just tens across the board. Just mm. yeah. If. If if I if I had to rank the carnival revels end and <laughs> in this, I don't uh-huh. know if I could. You know, it's like it's it's like a it's like your it's like a uh, it's it's like a feast. You know, what yeah, I'm yeah. It's like you're, you're buried in riches. It's definitely um, something. Yeah, 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 the, yeah. So 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 uh, Shaka basically had an idea that like he oh, would no. go in the morning portal and. See, 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 see if you could hear any buzz about, you know, like about uh, p- people moving wards and, right. uh, mm-hmm. and he, uh, you know, tried to strike up some conversation, went really badly, and he was talking really loudly. Uh, I believe the other rivals were Scooby doing it uh, at the door, kind of observing. Uh, As we do. And- oh, we yeah. were trying not to laugh because the room was silenced, but we had opened the door. So, you know, we didn't want to like. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I was I, I I I was trying to talk really loud over the bar that was singing, but I was talking really really loud and trying to <laughs> make small talk about weather to to people at a bar. It was great. It was very natural. It was great. Uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. So so good. Mm-hmm. Um. But yeah, we leave. We well, we don't leave you. We see you. Uh, the camera zooms in at, through the cloud, Simpson style, but down to uh oh. the. Right <laughs> to the outside of the House of Inspired Hands, uh, right at E for Everyone. Thank you, Ray. Um, where uh, you all have just exited with um, a uh, an assurance from Zephyr that they will look into, uh, you know, they will they will poke around and and see what they can do uh, to aid your efforts. And um, what would you like to do next? I turn to the group. I'm like, well, I've got my stuff taken care of. I mean, I like we got local people. Good. Like I got the the scales sort of talked about, you know, I'm, I'm good to go on a journey with anyone else if because my, my to do list is done toward the day. I think what we talked about before, I'm just going to go ahead and move past that. Uh, I think what we <laughs> talked about left on the list is just to set up this town hall that we wanted to have. And then if yeah. we wanted to circle around to any temples and, and guild houses in the North Ward. Um, but I think that's sort of where we are. Yeah, I think we should either um, maybe uh, try a personal approach, like personally invite people to the town hall, or yeah. we could like print up some sort of, uh, you know, uh, or like de- design like some sort of flyer or something that would you would put in people's, uh, you know, uh, either like at people's houses or like if there's some kind of like community area signpost area you put stuff on community yeah. board I think so. both work I, I think both are probably a good idea especially the personal touch would be appreciated by the residents of the ward like actually seeing but you know maybe there are you know maybe there are you know we could probably put up something in the yawning portal and other places around town to let people know it's happening it also kind of increases it increases the awareness around town that we are doing something and, and who knows what ears may open from that. Mm. Yeah. So good, I, good, bad or otherwise. Yeah. So like, I'd like to get on that. I guess I could reach out to uh, a un- unnamed, uh, unnamed neighbor um, uh, because like she seemed to have the ins about town um, and sort of get like a list of like the influential folks that we should uh, focus on. Um, and then, you know, when when should we have this though? Maybe in like a week or something or, uh, you know, like to give people like enough time to come. I don't, I, I don't want to say it's tomorrow, y'all. 
Get over yeah. here. Ten day feels right. Yeah, it's a week. Ten day. What are we using this campaign? <laughs> oh, is it ten? Uh, what is yeah, the calendar so, based off of? Yeah, the, there um, are. We're there. on the Gregorian calendar. So oh, yes, yes the Gregorian calendar. It was a Janus, the great faced like, Avernus god. Yes, we all Correct. know. Wait, what? What is happening? What? No. Okay. 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 Hold on. Hold on. So, for people who don't know, the Forgotten Realms calendar, oh, a week okay. is ten days long, and there okay. are three. There are three weeks in a month. There are four. Three, they're actually four. Oh, okay. oh, you're right. Three weeks in a month. No, you're right. Three okay. Weeks. So yes, there are three ten days in a month. So every month is thirty days long. So, right, but thanks. nobody ever remembers that. So <laughs> everything in the Forgotten Realms goes by the Gregorian calendar, unless you're really immersive. <laughs> I think the first well, like, time there's... I was aware of that, it broke my me for a moment. I was like, wait, <laughs> wait a minute. It's in the exact same heliocentric universe. How is that possible? I think there's, uh, no, no, no. There, there's definitely a Gregory in Waterdeep that's been oh. trying to convince people. <laughs> <Yeah>. Poor, <laughs> poor convince Gregory. People, poor Gregory in his like, calendars. This, they're just not selling yeah. at all. Yeah, like, I mean, like he he like he hands them out to folks. He's like, "Come on, y'all!" This we should know. invite Gregory to this because Gregory probably yeah. needs some seed funding. Maybe for maybe the, the Gregorian calendar can be the official yeah. calendar of the North Ward. <laughs> right. Absolutely, we'll bring him in. We've got some confusing. crazy ideas. <laughs> this has this has big it's only the Navajo ideas. Nation yeah. and celebrates daylight saving time energy. Yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to be clear, we're the bad guys in that situation. Um, <laughs> Uh, um, great, yeah, yeah, but a week feels about right. Okay. However long that is. <laughs> right, Ten exactly. Days, we don't good. need to know, just, you know. Yes, a week. <laughs> yeah. um, yes, that'll give us time to, that'll give us time to decide and people time to spread the word. Yeah. So question, how expensive is paper in the Forgotten Realms? Oh. Does Canva exist? <laughs> we don't we just use, don't we just use magic for writing? I don't, wow, that's a oh. good point. Oh. Yeah. Papyrus or parchment can't be cheap. Well, oh, regular, yeah. like, so regular paper is not as expensive as you think it is. It, it's only when you get into like that spell casting paper and that good ink that it's like pricey. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Um, I, but, yeah. I but honestly you, think now, hear me out. This might sound a little weird, oh, but I'm so ready. Oh, no. Duo has designed some stuff for us in the past. He's made some no. signs. It's true. He's designed the cover of uh, wine uh, bottles. He That's has right. done some designs in the past. Yeah. Wait, so if we want to do it on the, if we want to save some money. Okay, we don't need uh, to save money. <laughs> Or no 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 no. That's what well, we do want to save money. I mean, saving money. I mean, okay. We have money. Come I'm on. sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. Duo has a passion for design. No one said he's good at it. Absolutely. I I, I like this idea though. What if we? I still have this disguise self painting set. What if we take a nice flyer that we like and just like erase the details we don't like and then put our info in it and then it's like <laughs> our flyer now. Like that's the I like the magic ink what? will do it. That's right. Yeah. I'm giving credit uh, to the original why do, why do poster ever, designer. I mean, I mean, yeah, truly. Okay, <laughs> suddenly <laughs> a bunch, a bunch of bluebirds yeah. descend on Gaza. Like, don't you exactly. want a flyer? <laughs> Just don't hire Gaza. He plays the right ball. Too. Um, I would like to remind you all please. that Dahani is here. Like she's not here. Oh, she's right. there. I know that is the obvious bird. solution. Right, right, right. <laughs> God, just, how know, quickly we, we go we from were, being worried about her safety and her life to being like, I, we, we get are to absolutely pay. giving <laughs> her her own agency. She's not here to contribute. So that's what that, we were <laughs> oh, respecting. We were respecting. Right. Very true. This is what's up. That's that's what's going on there. We didn't sign it. her up for anything while she was not present. I love it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, <laughs> but, 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 okay. uh, we, sh we should ask the, the honey. no 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 okay so you all have this conversation while walking back from the house of inspired hands back to troll skull which actually looking at the map is literally a straight shot so yeah house of inspired hands is all the way on the west side of town but there's one street that gets you right there mm -hmm. and i love super that super easy I on the camera crew sorkin does not have to pay an extra budget it's <laughs> right. just it's just straight one straight down the yeah. entire time <laughs> exactly it's beautiful y'all really should take a look at the map of water deep it's great oh, yeah uh, <laughs> that's great yeah yeah it's one like it's one street and then like you have to like go between some houses to get to troll Skull alley but that's so good yeah nice. that's nice all right uh so yeah I'm, back I'm that. 
so back at if so i'm not gonna i'm not gonna uh, railroad you all back to troll skull immediately like if you would like to take some time on your way there as you get back into the north ward to tell some people about what you would like to do the plans for this town hall etc cetera, etc cetera. so i just i was just it just amused me that you can really just like take one street and get home yeah, i love that um, in that case, I think we can all go back, but the first place I would like to go once we have these flyers, there's a glassblowers guild house in the North Ward. It's one of only a couple of like artisan guild houses in our ward. So that, it feels like we should check in with them once we have deets on paper. Cool. Um, so as you get back to Troll Skull, uh, Dahani is there. Oh, um, good. She's just sitting, she's sitting in the, the main room with duo and brian who are just kind of like puttering about um but she's just she's uh it's not quite lunchtime because the castle lanterns and the house of inspired hands are pretty close to each other and it's probably going to take you what half an hour to an hour to get back time is funky and i don't feel like looking at the legend um (laughs) (laughs) so yeah dahani's there she's uh probably just sitting there with a drink and like a piece of paper, like she's doodling something. And she, she says, Oh, you guys are back. I, I didn't think I'd beat you back, but. Oh, we had to stop, uh, you know, taking care of our errands for the day. Make sure one of ours wasn't kidnapped. Go talk to some people, you know, just part. I think is, is making sure that one of us isn't kidnapped uh, an errand for every day that somebody's not here. No, but it's 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 an occasion. Yeah, it, it, you. It's sometimes the to do list can change depending on what you need to do versus mm-hmm. what needs to be done. Mm-hmm. I got gotcha. you. Mm-hmm. I mean, I appreciate it. I really oh, do yeah. because you know, last time this happened, it was you, and we got back a bloody hat that we right. thought was a head, and it was just like a whole bunch. And of I bad have stuff. no bad issues about that. I feel totally okay that you guys definitely didn't recognize me from a, go- a doppelganger. It's- Can you roll me a deception check, please? Oh, I'd love, <laughs> I'd love to roll a deception check on that. Wow. Oh. <laughs> That's a, it's a 12 plus two. It's a 14. Okay. Gosrick's trying, you know, he's, he's, he's really, trying. like, he's trying. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, no, no, uh, no resentment there at all. No, mm-hmm. it's all good, guys. It's all good. Mm. And now we got the new chefs, and I don't even need to cook anymore. Ah, oh, it's like I'm not even needed around here. <laughs> wow, Nazarek, you're. It's a little overt. What? It's a little. <laughs> you're. It's a little overt. This feeling that you have. I'm not, I'm, no, no, you haven't been listening. I'm not feeling anything. I'm, I'm like, uh-huh. I, I'm, so, so that's the, how could I, that be an issue? Cause I'm not feeling it, right? I'm so not Lisa feeling that. In. I'm not jealous of Leaf and his cooking abilities, whatever. Wow. Oh, you sound like me before I killed Siraj. Oh, wait, who are we killing? We're Wait, not what? killing anyone. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Y- yet that I don't escalated know. from like zero to like 11 yeah like, for a moment it's like i i like don't get me wrong i don't know how to kill a ghost i'm not gonna kill that's what i was gonna say yeah, yeah. it was only like one no. to eight for me because leaf's already dead so i don't know how bad it can be right i mean you could try to exercise him but yeah. no no but guys this is what i'm saying you you you're lying to yourself and to us Guys are just gonna make an insight check on himself if he realizes that that's what Ooh, he's doing. Like, 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 yeah. How do you self insight? Like, no, no, hold, oh, no. hold on. I, I'm here for this. I'm yeah. here for this. This is, this is. Yeah, I, I'm here for this. I didn't say <laughs> don't. I just have never heard of anyone <laughs> insighting. No, right, you, because it. you, it's like that moment Feels right. where you tell someone exactly what they need to hear, but do they listen? Like, yeah. do, mm-hmm. like, do they actually mm-hmm. listen to you? Yeah, pretty cool. Yeah, let's I see like what it. Happens. Okay, thank God. It was either a two or a twelve, and it settled on the twelve. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Know oh. thyself. Interesting. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's like if you are feeling left out or unneeded. Well, it's just like the shop ran by itself while we were gone. The manor's sort of doing its own thing. The baby dragon's managing itself, like right. 
Right, but why, why do you think everyone that we left behind was able to manage that? Yeah, because you said that's a it testament up. to your. That's a testament to your ability to keep things going. Fair. Oh. Oh yeah. I look. There delegation is part of of uh, you know growing in your position. Right. I, you know. Do you think that by the time I retired as an archaeologist, I was digging up every site? No, I was in there stealing. Sh- I mean, cataloging <laughs> priceless artifacts. And yeah, stuff. yeah. When you retired, yeah, of course. Retired. Yes, voluntarily retired. I love, you know what? Thank you guys. I really appreciate this because you made me realize I'm a fantastic manager. And that is honestly what I needed to take away. Too far. Oh, too a far. little, <laughs> a little, but I'm going to say, yeah, you better no. about that. No, 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 no it's, <laughs> I'll take it. Okay, I'm going to think about right. uh, uh, Duel. Let's talk about your five year plan for a moment. And like, <laughs> God, oh, take no. a step, step away <laughs> and put his arm around uh, Duo to have a conversation with him. Five, five, five years? What? Yeah, it's five years. You can't be wanting to be incorporeal forever. Come on. I mean, wild starter point. <laughs> All right, and then that that <laughs> that goes off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> that goes off. Yeah. That goes that Guys way. Are exit stage. <laughs> One yeah. of the most important DM skills for the rivals of Waterdeep is to know when a conversation just has to happen off. Yeah, camera. exactly. <laughs> when, when do it. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I'm sorry. Two things they have yeah, to please. know when a conver- when a conversation needs to go off stage mm. and when duo's voice is needed. Right. <laughs> right. Oh, you're, right. Yeah. you're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Wow. I love it. So as as uh, as duo and Goswick kind of you know excellent p- pursued by managerialism. Is that a word? It is now. Yeah. No. Um, it is now. <laughs> yeah. uh, the rest of you are just kind of left watching that disappear. Um. um but yeah, what, like, uh, I mean, what a time is it around? I'm going to say it's about like one or two o'clock. Okay. I I want to go if if there's nothing else here, I do want to go and um start to, uh, you know, I I, I do want to go to uh unnamed citizen's house and oh, yeah. uh, okay. ask unnamed citizen to like like, like, like we're still going to do the personal things, but. I want unnamed citizen to spread the. I don't know why. It's good. Keep going. Could have used Jane Doe, but I like unnamed citizen. (laughs) To to uh, spread the word first, and all the you know the gossip circles and all that. Yeah, absolutely. Um, So while you all are left, uh, kind of wondering what exactly is about to happen between Duo and Gosrick, Chaka uh, leaves out of the manor and heads uh, six doors down and across the street. Uh, to the house of unnamed citizen. Very precise. Okay, I knock on the door. I also love that the house of the unnamed citizen sounded like it was in cat, like in title cat. They're like the house of the unnamed citizen oh, yeah. coming this fall right. on NBC. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah exactly. <laughs> if, if, if there's subtitles on the rival show, it'll say unnamed citizen and mm-hmm. then the text. Yeah, for sure. So that's our spinoff show. <laughs> the house of the unnamed citizen yeah uh, that's yes. actually really funny about like all like the npcs in the rivals universe <laughs> like that's that's we that's fun that. yeah, yeah 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 that's a fun stream yeah 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 a, a very brief of a very brief sidebar if you've ever played the latest like life is strange tr- true colors the captions of the npcs are like glasses guy uh <laughs> uh uh hallway guy uh uh ice cream girl it's very very funny like it's almost like they left a bunch of placeholders that they either they forgot to place them in or like they just wanted it to be funny it's hilarious anyway <laughs> we gotta start very doing funny. that for D- for dming your scenes yes yeah, so like don't even bother giving them names just give them brackets like info guy yeah. and magic person and sales dude <laughs> <laughs> yeah i love this uh, after after a, a little bit of time, like maybe 15, 30 seconds, uh, the door opens and there you see an uh, unnamed citizen uh, who is uh, who actually looks like I'm not actually looks. So it's not like she shouldn't look, but she looks, uh, you know, pleased to see you. Hello. Hey, hey, I'm so sorry. I forgot to get your name the last time we uh, talked. Oh, it's Maggie. Maggie, Maggie. Hi, I'm Shaka. Um, as you, nice to, as you nice might know, to meet you again. Yes. Hey, um, uh, can, can I come in? Oh, 
oh, absolutely. And uh, she steps back to let you in and her house is, is, is modest. It's, um, it's, uh, <laughs> uh, it's, it's very cozy. Um, it looks like, you know, an older, like, like an older grandmother's house, except there's no plastic on the furniture, uh, uh, is, <laughs> but everything looks, go ahead. Is, is, is there like a big thing on the coffee table with like walnuts and stuff in it? Like a, yes. A, a joint? Okay. Just making sure. Uh, all right. Uh, yeah. So, um, uh, I, 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 I say, um, I'm really sorry to bother you. Um, uh, uh, but I wanted to follow up on our conversation from last time, um, about you mentioning, you know, some of the reasons why some people might be moving out, um, and that kind of stuff. Um, do yeah. you have a, a, a couple minutes to chat? Oh, absolutely. Uh, would you like a, a cookie? Uh, what what kind of cookie? Uh, 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 oatmeal, oatmeal. Of course, sure. Uh, do you uh, want raisins or no? I've got both kinds. Oh, the healthy options. I'm rife. I'm like an inside check on myself <laughs> to <laughs> rife through the decisions now. Uh, <laughs> um, I will take the raisins, please. Oatmeal raisin oh. sounds great. Absolutely. She invites you into her like sitting room and everything, like I said, everything looks uh, unbelievably cozy. And uh, you sit down on the sofa, on the the little two seer and it's like super cozy. You like, you know, you, Ooh, I'm, you I'm, I'm, get I'm, in, like, there. in there. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> and she comes out of the little kitchen area with, uh, with a, with a plate of cookies and uh, sets them down on the table before you, before she sits down herself. Yeah. Um, no, I help, help, help yourself. Um, so, yes, you 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 did mention something like a um, like a town hall or a, or a meeting or something like that. Yeah. So we're thinking of well, no, we're definitely having the town hall next week, um, and we just wanted to know if you know you could kind of spread the word amongst people that you know in the town um, that we're looking to reinvest in 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 the ward. Um, and we'll definitely be going out to, to people individually and setting up flyers and all that stuff. But I thought it might be good to come from you first. And, and then we can do like the follow up there. Of course. I mean, I'm just a, I mean, I'm frankly in the, in the grand scheme of things, I'm just a little old nobody, but I can definitely mention it to my knitting group this week. Well, there are no nobodies in the North Ward, right? That, that's like what we're trying to change here. Everybody's a somebody, okay? And th I think that's one reason why people were in, the, in, in, in like Shaka kind of stands up, says, I believe this is why some of the people were moving out, right? Because people felt like nobodies. Like they saw strange things happening in the manor. They saw like Laurel Silverhand and like, and, and like Avadra coming to the manor, maybe not coming around to, the, to like a, the other parts. And we're here to change that. Roll me a charisma check with advantage. Straight charisma. Yeah, straight careers. Big rolls, big rolls, big rolls. Okay, that's a 21. 21! Who? Blackjack. Um, she <laughs> she has taken one of her own cookies. And as you say this, as you stand up and you point your finger, um charismatically and begin this speech while the uh the heraldry of Waterdeep begins to wave behind you and music is coming from somewhere and you've no idea where it's coming from <laughs> um <laughs> as you finish speaking she gives you a polite little like it's a very polite little clap it's a little grandmotherly clap I mean she says well I, well that all sounds that all sounds very good very very good um uh, cer certainly, I will. Uh, I will tell who I can. Where is this town hall being held? Uh, it's actually going to be at uh, Trollsco Manor. Hmm. Is that a good idea? Do you think, or like, do you think that there's somewhere else that people might feel more comfortable with meeting? Well, she sits back down. Well, no, she is sitting down. You are standing up. Um, I think. It's a 
and this is just my opinion, mind you, but it's a good opportunity to show people that the manor isn't as weird as it is, or at the very least, its weirdness is charming. Okay. Okay. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Then I think that that might be a, a good idea to have it there. I was just thinking that maybe, maybe we want to have it another place to show that there's other parts. Everything's not centered around uh, the manor, but if you think it that it'll it'll work, I think that we will have I, at least the first one there because we definitely intend this to be a reoccurring thing to make sure that we're checking in on the needs right of the uh, uh, yeah. I'm, I mean, I'm totally like committing everyone to stuff that we haven't talked about. Uh, <laughs> this is why we don't let Shaka go alone. Yeah. <laughs> Shaka also again. should not have power of attorney. We're learning. <laughs> we're learning. <laughs> she 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 pats your she she pats your 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 hand as you kind of like say all of this, and she says, "I think that you should um, go with your instincts." Um, I'll just tell people that the uh, that a town hall is being planned, and once you start to spread the word and the flyers go out, I suppose you'll uh, have more information on those. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I I think that like that's great. Um, I also want to. Um, so I've had one of these cookies. Uh, is it good? Is it a good cookie? I'm oh yeah, it's a good cookie. No, okay, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I'm like, I'm like, are you asking? No, Maggie? no, no. I'm asking I, I thought you were like, like that was very awkward. Response. That was this very is a awkward. Good cookie, Maggie. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it's it's a good cookie. Oh, okay, all right, all right. Just, it's very, it's very soft. Just want to make sure because if it was nasty, I was gonna probably have to roll a deception or something to uh, <laughs> to make sure that I'm still keeping up a positive demeanor. No, it's a it good down. cookie. Okay, sweet. Nice, warm, soft. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so like uh, I'm I'm like, whoa, you made a lot of cookies. Uh must be must be kind of tough for you to you to eat all those on your own, right? <laughs> or like are those for are the are are they for other folks like the knitting group, maybe? Yes, uh, some of them are uh, so, uh, some of them are, are for the knitting group, but uh, are you do you want to take home some cookies? I mean, I don't want to take them, but these uh, cookies are very good. You ever thought about uh, maybe having a little uh, side business, maybe? Oh, or like no. supplying the manor with cookies, maybe? Uh, I've never thought about that before, but um, why don't you take this this plate and I, I can, I have more. Why don't you just- well, I don't want to deprive fr from the knitting group. I mean. You're not depriving the knitting group of cookies. It's technically not my week to bring treats anyway, but Tilly is still setting up her house and hasn't got a chance to start baking yet, so. Well, tell Tilly I said hi in that, uh, you know, I'm sorry uh, about the cookies, but I think it might be a, a good idea. I'll bring them over there. Maybe I'll like I'll put some on the front desk and as as the people come, maybe we'll give them like a cookie and maybe it'll catch on and maybe maybe, maybe it'll be a thing like Maggie's cookies might become a thing. No. After. Don't don't you try to convince this old girl to get back into business now. Do you back make into cookies? business? That, oh, I Maggie, to... Maggie, do you, you, have, you have a little history here, Maggie, with cookie selling? <laughs> maybe I made maybe I made cookies in my youth and maybe I decided not to decided not to, to I, in my I've retired I've retired okay. from baking okay well well I don't want to pressure you into doing anything that you don't want to do um but these cookies are very good and I just wanted you to know that I appreciate it so well Sorry, this is just going wild. Well, <laughs> um, uh, well uh, thank, 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 thank you, Maggie. I really appreciate it. Um, and uh, we'll come back to uh, let you know how, how things go, um, and to give everybody like the final, like you know, date and time for the town hall. Certainly, certainly, and it was a, a pleasure to see you again. A pleasure as well. Thank you. She pats uh, your cheek. Oh, sweet. As as I'm leaving, can I like? Uh, no, nah, nah, I won't do it. That's uh, fine. Uh, okay, I'll I'll just leave. <laughs> okay, <laughs> I like wanted to roll. Well, okay, no, I am going to do it now. Okay, okay. I want to roll <laughs> in in an investigation as I'm leaving. I just want to okay. see if there's anything that is just this nice, sweet woman 
in Waterdeep, uh, which is a town that has a lot of things going on. I just want to see if there's anything that would looks a little bit off. Just anything sure. that looks a little bit off. Roll me, uh, roll that investigation. Yeah. Roll that beautiful D20. No suspiciously bone filled oven in the kitchen, you know. Right. <laughs> Love it. Uh, I don't know. I think it's telling of us more so that we just can't have we we our life has never been filled with just nice things. There's I mean, always a water catch. deep is right. yeah, 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 man. <laughs> w- w- water deep is a is a city. Right. Uh, yeah. It's definitely a city. Uh, uh eleven. So no, n- nothing looks out of the ordinary to you. Like she e- e- there's there's doilies and she's got like a uh, uh, she, you know, she, she's got, uh, you know, it looks like a, a nice old lady's house. Sweet. Thank you, Maggie. Bye. And then I head back to the manor okay. with a bunch of cookies. All right. Uh, what have you all been doing while this, this visit probably took about uh, 10 minutes or so and 10, 15 minutes. And what have y'all been up to? Imagine we'd want to get a start with Dahani on the flyers. Does that seem right? Okay. Yeah. So uh, this is trying to train Fenris to drop off flyers. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, roll that animal handling check. Yeah, yeah oh. I want to know how this goes. <laughs> oh, no. Not using digital dice. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> They've been swinging mm. today. Yeah. Nope, they betrayed me on Thursday. No, thank you. <laughs> Can't even put them in dice jail. That's the worst part. I'm so glad I have a plus eight. Oh, <laughs> nice. Sixteen. Nice. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Um. So you you hand him flyers and you tell him to go and then you tell him to drop and it it's effective, but the flyers like like the piece of paper that you have it's like you have to. It's obvious. It's got teeth marks in it and a little bit of drool. So oh, I thought it was like be gentle. Okay, I okay, mean, okay. So like like okay. like holding an egg. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, uh, okay. The egg's gonna be sloppy. This though, is this is the yeah. biggest visual right now of a, yeah. of a no, young so, dire wolf trying to like I feel like this is gentle for, for a dire wolf. Right? You know? <laughs> like yeah, uh, so not, I, not, like I not shredding. Him, <laughs> why don't I have I have a scroll, but it's not in reach. Um <laughs> Oh, like, so it, it's, it. ro- it's rolled up. Okay, oh, okay, oh okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay, Why would I just okay. go, here's a piece of, par- oh my God. Like we That's handle like I'm a punch a, card I'm and Fenris is just like, oh. Like, I do <laughs> love that that is kind of low-key what most of us seem to have assumed though, which is wild. <laughs> yeah. Myself oh, included, flyers. to be very clear. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> no, I rolled it up. And it was like. <laughs> okay, okay. So, it's basically like I put a bag over the front and there's just like rolled. So much sense. Oh my oh, so god! Pulled, oh no, no, no! Hold on, hold on. This changes things. Mm. So he's got like a little bag of, in in yeah. front. He like pulls a scroll out and like hands it to somebody. Yes, That's adorable. I That's love what I was that. Thinking. Yeah. That's okay. Great. Okay, I'm sorry for assuming. I'm so sorry like, for assuming. Here, I'm going <laughs> to find some parchment. <laughs> <laughs> I have it. Keep talking. Yes, yes, yes. So um, this this works. Um, so yeah, you like you can either have one that he, like that's in his front or like one of his saddlebags. He can yeah, he can like reach behind and like pull a scroll out and hand to somebody, and that's just adorable. That's yes. that's precious. Fun fact: this is actually a map of favorite. <laughs> Perfect. Oh god. Um, and then so then. Shaka's gone. Salise is is training Fenris to do the handoff. Gazric is discussing five year plans with Duo. So Kent and Virgil and Dahani, y'all would be doing the art thing. Seems, seems like it. Seems <laughs> like it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> um, so those three are kind of sitting at a table talking, of, like you know, talking like just over like general flyer design, like you know, yeah. Yeah, yeah, like you know, there's a ver- there's a draft that like has the six of us on it, and then we're like, nah, I don't, I think it's we're supposed to be decentralizing ourselves, you know? Right, and we're like the you know we're basically working on the messaging, but then we like it's too much because we really want an eye catching design right. on the flyer. That's not us, so you know maybe we kind of put the manner or maybe a crest or 
but yeah, like the messaging keeps kind of, you know, it keeps boiling down to basically, you know, town hall troll skull manner with the date and time. All of our reflusive language is just like, it's too much. It's too much. Yeah. <laughs> There's a so draft I, that's like just top to bottom text. Yeah. And you're like, yeah, nah, that's yeah. not. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So what we've got so far, so I think of, of the various drafts, because Dahani is actually a pretty quick, like as far as sketches go, she's pretty quick about this. Yeah, You've got good. like three or, three or four designs on the table, one of which is, um, it says town, like they all say town hall at the top. Uh-huh. And then like the upper, the upper third of the rest of that, there's a couple different designs there. There's one with, you know, a sketch of Troll Skull Manor. There's one with a sketch of um, the Six of You, which are all like adorable little like boxy stick figures. Like think um, think art and audios design, like art and audios art. Um, <laughs> in that in that kind of, uh, that kind of sketchy, um, sketchy, not finished first draft kind of thing. Um, then there's one that's just like, it's very roughly like water, like the 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 flat or the symbol of water deep or whatever. Uh-huh. Um, and then uh, they all, then then the rest of them like they all just say like uh, you know date time come you know what what we're going to be talking about like it it's it says revivify the North Ward at the bottom Love stuff it. like that. <laughs> so um, actually, let me roll a dexterity check for Dahani Ooh. to see how these go. Ooh. Is she staying within the lines? <laughs> oh, oh, oh no! You know the important thing is the messaging. You know, like the, the yeah, important yeah. thing I is actually, the messaging. If that's really that's getting right. out there, art, that's right. art, art is obviously essential. Yeah, but the important thing is people will know something is going on. Right, also, and the art. I, go ahead. I was gonna say, you ever try to make something with your the two people who commissioned it standing oh. over your shoulder? Like, oh, like don't come for me like this. This is too. This is like, this is like, don't, please don't come for me like this. <laughs> Dahani <laughs> rolled an eight for everybody. Yeah. Uh, everybody concerned, um, but it's it's about this time that Shaka comes back in with a plate of cookies. Mm-hmm. Oh, everything is better. <laughs> hey, everybody. Uh, so Maggie. The woman that I met earlier is fantastic. She's going to spread the word about the town hall. Um, well, the, the, the like initial word. And she's a great baker. And she brought us some cookies. Oh, God. Um, is Gosrick here? Now, only I know this, Good but time. there are less cookies than she gave me because I definitely <laughs> her on the way here. I think um, anyone could maybe investigate. Just, can, I get, can, your, yeah, can I get like a, 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 perce- a perception <laughs> check on like the gaps in the plate and Shaka's yeah, face? Go, like, right. Just go ahead. Just... <laughs> go oh, ahead God. and make those perception checks. I'm not Crumbling. making one because oh I assume well, he's eaten no, some of them and I'm proud of him for it. Yeah, yeah. That's a, that's a, that's another crit fail on, on <laughs> uh, those parts. So, why do you laugh so much with my critical <laughs> failures? Oh my God. complex. It's not just you. Look. <laughs> Me too. I also got a nat one. as us go. around the corner. Also got to have one on this perception check. I feel like I, I need to take back the sarcasm about how smooth Shaka is now. Because... Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, uh, to us, absolutely. What are it's we? all karma. No, no, it's no. karma. It's all it's karma. It's all karma. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. It's all just, yeah. Is, am I still there or am I out still training Fenris? Oh, I, I assumed that you were training him inside. If you were oh, outside, okay. you would have, if you were outside, you just would have seen Shaka walk up right. with the plate. Right. Okay, so I'm inside and I just look at Shaka. So you took food from strangers again? <laughs> well, we are trying to, um, you know, uh, get, get the good word of the yeah. community. And it's always nice if someone welcomes you in, if you reject their food, you know, it's kind of seen as a as a disrespectful thing, you know? But so did I, you have to... <sighs> but, but how are they? One... Oh my god! <laughs> oh, they're very just... good, Kent. Yeah, uh, sorry, Celise. I'm sorry. I just—they look really good. And they smell amazing. <laughs> no, Celise is just like, oh my god! I, I, thankfully my spells are renewed for today. I hope they don't kill any of you. Yeah, it's very just take the point. It's fine. It's great. Yeah. So here's m- my idea: is that we each have one, of course, but maybe we oh. put some. Because I'll say that I have, I don't know, uh, how many would you say I have, Donnie? Um, Can I roll for it? <gasps> yeah, sure. Roll me. Um, D100. God, no. no that's so, that's so many. I, I just came um, with like a wagon. wagon of- <laughs> roll me 2D8. 
Sweet. I know those are like the Mrs. Fields nibblers if you had a (laughs) hundred. All right, fifteen cookies. Oh wow! Yes. So you 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 have I'll say you have returned with fifteen cookies. Were there more on the plate when Uh, you left? Maybe allegedly. 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 (laughs) No, I can prove it. <laughs> um, <laughs> prove it. Uh, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. On yeah. The plate. All right. So, so I let, let's just so definitely have some, but let's try to leave maybe, maybe I don't know, three or four at the front, and oh. as people come in, maybe we can offer it as like a check-in thing, and we can see if they That's become, cute. you know, it 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 could be a thing, right? So. Um, I like that. So, like, f- feel free to, like, uh, have some because they are fantastic. And if you don't have them, I definitely will. I'm just telling you up front. Um, uh, <laughs> and, b- yes. but, but no, she, no, she's a very nice. And, um, you know, I, I think that she, she said that she'll be spreading the word to her knitting group. I didn't know there were knitting groups in the North Ward. Uh, uh, so, you know, there's all kind of things going on. That's kind of like a guild, right? Sort of. Yeah. Uh, I mean. Like a knitting guild. <laughs> um <laughs> So uh, yeah, so um, how 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 are the uh, flyers going? Uh good. Uh, I think Kent grabs one that has troll skull as the art to sort of show the location, in addition to just saying it, and we'll show that one to Shaka. Okay. Okay. See so, yeah, this this one, uh, as I described, has town hall at the top. Actually. There are, there are a couple of different drafts. There's Town Hall at the top, and then there's one that actually has Revivify the North Ward at the top because, you know, to, to try and decide what kind of messaging you want to be oh, yeah. prominent. So um, whichever one that you want to hand off, it's it's good. Um, this version of Troll Skull Manor, because Dahani rolled an eight, looks <laughs> a little... Right, I forgot about that. They, they are <laughs> sketches, so... Uh, it's, right, right. But this one, this one looks a little... A little rundown. <laughs> okay. Because okay. like um, I was I, like, they, they he bumped my hand while I was while I was sketching it, and I just I just kept I just, going I just with thought it. the line needed to be a little over to the right, but it's fine. Um, yeah, yeah. Kent's like Kate got caught on on the. Uh, yeah, no, don't <laughs> let me around the commissioned artist ever again. Um, <laughs> okay, uh, this this is a good start. Uh, let me make one suggestion though. Um, Maybe we don't want to have the manor on the flyer. Yeah. Like maybe we just have like a picture of some natural thing in the ward. Like, like maybe it it could just be a bunch of buildings or like a local area so that even though we're having the meeting here, I think taking the focus off of that is important for the imagery because I feel like if we give it to people with the manor on it, they're going to be like, Oh, here's, Here's uh, the most important thing in the ward again. Uh, yeah. You know, mm-hmm. being on this thing. Sure, so, I see that. I don't know. I mean, we, well, if we have the uh, manor in it, there should be other oh. things in it, like as well. No, to, to, why don't we, why don't we put like the to sword part of the community? Because that's yeah. the, that's the walking statue that's in, it's one of anyway, the, the walking statues of the city that's in our ward, sort of mm-hmm. a symbol, yeah. a very visible symbol of our yes. ward. Yeah. And the walking statue is pretty huge. So, yeah. Even, even, even though the manners in the picture wouldn't be like the dominant thing in there. So yeah, I think it's yeah. a good idea. All That's right. Fun. So uh, Dahani is going to uh, do another sketch. This is going to be great. Oh, we we got to give Dahani advantage. We got we to give Dahani advantage. Okay. Uh, all right. All right. All right. All right. <laughs> they, all right. They, can take, they can take my inspiration. That's totally fine. Oh, wow. Okay, good. 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 Right. Oh, hey, there, you go. <laughs> there it was. It just you know you're you're still shaking out the injuries and you're warming up and you know we yeah. hit you with this like on the cuff. So yeah, that's you, you did you did. So what she ends up with is a, and this this sketch could all could almost be like an actual piece of art at this point. It takes her about ten minutes to do, but she um there's a it's this this the sword the the sword maiden. And then, like beneath the sword maiden, there is just like a scape of um, a scape of just buildings, you know. Um, and then, like one of the buildings definitely looks like Troll Skull Manor, but it just looks like, you know, the sword maiden over the North Ward. So, I think this is great. 
I think it looks awesome. What do you guys think? I love it. That's the appropriate tone. Top notch. Sure. All right. Um, how many of these do we want? Uh, are we going to like reproduce one or like are you going to individually make each one? Like, can we uh, magically just reproduce it? I'm literally this might going be this styles. might be a good this <laughs> might be a paste. good chance for us to actually you know perhaps there might be there there might be um, an artisan or a you know someone we can hire and this might be a good way for us to make that initial foray yeah. and and simply and simply say we would like to start helping to invest in the North Ward starting now. Would someone like to make me an intelligence or history check? Let's see what my history is. I'll do. I'll do a, a history check. Got a plus. I'm so good at history, and I. I was like, failed. please. Oh! I was like, oh! Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I need you to understand minute. that a, a crit fail for Kent on history <laughs> yeah, total, a totals a what? Bad. <laughs> a si- oh, a sixteen is a crit fail. Yeah. Yeah. God. Well, but are you you proficient in history, right? I, yeah. So technically, I can't get less than a twenty-four on history. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Because I was about to say, like, that's not. That's not yeah. correct. No, <laughs> yeah, exactly right. Yeah, technically, since I'm proficient, I can't get less than a 24. Okay. <laughs> Is that how proficiency works? At least. I, I still don't understand how proficiency works. I yeah. still don't. Well, it works weird for me because of my roguiness. I oh, see, yeah. I see, I see. Yeah. I see. Yeah, I, I have just... two, I have expertise, which doubles my proficiency, and I have reliable talent, which means anything I'm proficient in, if I roll less than a 10 on the die, I right. treat it as a 10. Right, right, right. I need proficiency in everything. <laughs> <laughs> That's the goal. What'd you roll, uh-huh. Celise? Oh, was I rolling something? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> if you want, I, assu- I assumed you were rolling. Again, I'm sorry for assuming, but I just no. said anybody who wanted to. No, I heard I can't get less than 24 and looked at my plus one in history and shut up. <laughs> All right. All right. I, I got a 21 in history. Okay. So, okay, Shaka. Right? So Kent, Gazerick, and Shaka all kind of realize the same thing. There are two temples in water deep right. generally that you may have a good uh, um that may be able to help you with this so um if you want to leave the north ward you could go to the castle ward for the font to, to the font of knowledge where you assume similarly to candle keep they have people who can like scribe things for you or like you know are able to like magically do paper stuff um, and then there's the Holy Hands House, which is a uh, multi, multi-deity multi temple in the North Ward. Oh, we should do that. We should go to the Holy Hands House since it's in the ward and check with them first, right? I, yep. Yeah. Makes sense. I agree. Excellent. Excellent. Um, so um, after about, I think maybe 10 more minutes, um, Dahani has a better version of this flyer like it's a little bit it's a little bit more sketched out uh, it's it looks like an actual this is a flyer that you could uh you know that you would put on like a notice board or something like that um and um what do you want it to like do you want it to say town hall at the top or do you want it to say revivify the north ward at the top i uh mm-hmm. Yeah. I, no, no, no. I don't need, I don't know either. <laughs> I I think we should have flyer A and flyer B, depending on who's getting it. Oh, that's interesting because maybe outside of the North Ward, it should say revivify the North Ward if we're putting up flyers in other places, because to just say town hall on flyers outside of the North Ward might suggest that we care about, I mean, that we are involving the other wards. No, you I were right. I yeah, I said yeah. what I said. <laughs> This is just the most casual <laughs> use of the word revivify I've had in a long time. <laughs> <laughs> and Salise is like, you're right. Yeah. Because <laughs> she's like looking through her book. Oh, yeah, I haven't done that in a while. <laughs> yeah, we're not frantically yelling it. Um, so, yeah, that would be if we're splitting it up, that would be my thought. OK, perfect. So Dahani drafts up two versions um, and uh, hands them off to you and you are free to do with them as you please um she says uh, i'm gonna stay here 
uh, because I want to. Right. That means that the DM doesn't want to have to remember that her character is here. That's right. That's right. That's we barely, we barely remember the characters here. So I'm like, mm, yeah, like <laughs> we're that. so used to tuning out whoever is DMing as their character. Gosric got kidnapped for my season for a reason. That was yeah, a choice well. you made. <laughs> oh, absolutely. And it's fun to make it feel like you're responsible for it. Yeah. Like, I'll be honest. <laughs> As a player, oh, no. <laughs> you made That's that good. choice all on your I own. Love it. sir. I it's love so good. It. All right. Uh, so the Holy Hands House is. You just go down that one street again. Yeah, we do. Oh. Is this oh, like going yeah, down ninety closer? Or basically, it's like just running it's up like and down. Just down right. of, yeah. Basically. But yeah, this is only a couple blocks away. Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. I need the uh, so map yeah, you all are looking at. Um, How's it look I on the outside? It. I'll put it back in the Oh, screen. what does the Holy Hands house look like? Does that have curb appeal? Of course it does. <laughs> of course it does. It's called the Holy <laughs> Hands house. <laughs> Sweet. Why, what? Let me let me find the thing. None for you. Right, none, none for me. Um, it is, it is a primarily unassuming. Like, I'm not gonna say it's an unassuming temple, but it doesn't look particularly, um, particularly lavish as it is a temple to all. Like, it is a temple to all deities, so it appeals right. to all who enter into it. Sure. Um, so, but yeah, you enter into it, and there, you know, there are clerics and and um, temple temple goers temple workers who are uh you know wandering around and doing doing their daily duties there are a couple of people who are you know in prayer or you know having quiet conversations and um a a young man approaches you uh he looks to be in his um early to mid 20s um and he says uh, uh greetings how how can how can we help you today uh I think maybe can you direct us towards uh, some the the area for maybe Denir or Agma or a scribe god of sorts. Um, is this for uh, is this for prayer? Is this for what is what is this concern? Uh, well, actually, we're from just down the road uh, from Trollskull Alley, um, mm-hmm. and uh, we are in the process of putting together a little uh, ward-wide town hall to sort of start, and I show him the one with Revivify on top, uh, to, to sort of Revivify the North. What, to, yeah. He, he looks at uh, It's dark now. <laughs> <laughs> but no, he, he, he looks at the, the oh, this is very, this is <laughs> Revivify, I get it. <laughs> uh, oh. oh, we're besties well. now. <laughs> <laughs> he looks at it and he says oh, well are you I'm, this is interesting uh, it, 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 is this something that you wish us to do you want with the flyer oh well we were actually hoping for some uh, first of all to, to spread the word um, and I have to stop talking with my hands and uh and then, and and second of all, we were, uh, you know, hoping that maybe we could ask for assistance in reproducing the flyers uh, to further spread the word. Interesting. Uh, of course, we could have the. Our, uh, we we do have some scribes here who could uh, aid in in reproduction of this uh, for a small donation. Of course. Oh, of course, of course. Um, how many of these would you like? Make a make a, a, a persuasion check for me. That's some number. Okay. Eighteen. Eighteen? Yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, he. This, uh, how many of these would you would you like? Twenty of each. Twenty of each. Twenty of each. Okay. Um. Yes, I think I think we we can do that. Um. And when do you need them by? Oh, I mean, the event is in about a week, whatever that means to you. And uh, <laughs> so, you know, ideally, at least a couple of days before then, the sooner the better, but not an immediate rush. Of course, of course. Um, yes, I think that we, 
absolutely can uh, have that done for you. Um, now, it, for another small donation, we can deliver like some parcel. of these to uh, to the, the various... You have two designs here. Is uh, this... One for within the ward uh, and shows the revivify, and then one... Uh, sorry, no, shows the town hall one. Uh, and then, and one, uh, you know, just for nearby locales, we're thinking of sort of starting an artist collective. So we were maybe thinking about visiting some guild halls and things like that outside of the ward uh, mm. and offering some involvement in that way. So these are for, uh, to put up in other wards. Okay. Shows the, revi oops, the revivify one. Excellent. Um, I think that, uh, of, you know, we, we could also assist in uh, distribution of these. Um, as you know, we, oh. the, 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 and I don't know if you've seen the Aarakocra that have recently been wandering around the city, decrying news to people. Um, we could definitely spread the word to them and they could, you know, make it a bit of a hot topic in Waterdeep. See if it becomes trending as they share it. Perhaps. And will and will it trend depending on where they are in Waterdeep? Right, right, right. Yes, right. you know, I, I I have heard that you know depending on the news in the, in the various wards, you know, some things are a little bit more popular in like the castle ward, and example, the trade. I mean, obviously, trader business is a bit more popular in the trades ward, and things like that. Kent uses ghost walk, turns ethereal, and never is seen again. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. I love it <laughs> so much. <laughs> uh, but yes, um, but yes, for uh, we we can definitely uh, arrange this for a a small donation. What is small? Can you quantify small donation? It, uh, it depends. Well, uh, uh, <laughs> you we asked him. For, yeah, trying I know, to be right? trying to be Fluster vague, him. and we're just like. Ah, bah, 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 bah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, roll, roll, Shaka, roll something. Roll what you <laughs> think you are trying to do. Uh, I mean, I'm just trying to get the facts. Like, I'm not trying to like just the facts. intimidate right. or anything. I'm Can I intimidate? <laughs> no. I, if I see Celeste uh, start to intimidate, I'm we are going to start paying person. for stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Like, now, you know, if it was not go. in the North Ward, it'd be different. I'd let you go. I, I, I didn't say don't pay. It's just it feels like there could be some extortion going on here. Oh, then, you mean from them to us? Oh. <laughs> Well then, Celise, uh, before you intimidate, may I ask you to roll an insight check? Sure. There's, a very, there's a very whiffy and iffy on like, you know, exchanging goods and services and value. And I'm just like, I don't know. How much does it cost here? Well, that's I don't because know. also just we refuse tip to establish. 500%, guys. Just tip 500%. <laughs> it makes everything easier. I promise okay, you. <laughs> I'm sorry. What am I doing? Am I doing insight? Yeah. Yeah, you can roll insight. 17. 17? Nice. Okay. Um, you get the impression that they don't they don't want to set a yeah. precedent for donation because it oh. if yeah. Respect. It, it, yeah. Yeah, they, they, they don't want to set a precedent because they don't know what any what any individual person can give. Yeah. So so um, they're not a printing press, so like they're not selling services here. Sure, sure, is, sure. And we've asked for, and we've we've asked for the, we've asked for the 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 duplication transcription of our of our flyers and distribution. Uh, he he says that for a for an increase on the donation that you give, they will yeah. distribute. How, how much was the the table that Gosser bought? Um, mm, two gold. Two gold. Two gold. I paid ten. I mean, Right. Well, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking. Stand by. Yeah, I'm. I'm thinking that. Yeah, hearing hearing the hearing the hesitation. Um, Virgil actually does. He he actually um, pulls two gold from somewhere yeah. and says, "We would appreciate a a steady hand on on both your artwork and your delivery." Yeah. I like that. I, I was um, able to roll something too as well. You said, right? I could. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> uh, I'd like to roll a religion. Uh, sure. I want to see if I can like 
uh, impress this, you know, like sort of like start, start, start talking that talk, you know, uh, um, go for it. Let's see how this works. Uh, all right. That is a 19, so 19 on this, but your investigation was a nat one. I love, yes. I love. Yes. Yes. So, <laughs> yeah. So, so my goal is to like, try to, I guess, I guess impress this person with my knowledge of of you know of of uh of uh what their things so, so that they would you know kind of soften up a bit you know? oh sure, c certainly i'm not going to make you do this in in vocals because i also do not like this is like el genio territory the knowledge of of the gods and things like that so uh there is some talk about religion 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 um religion. <laughs> the word this reformation like a, gets tossed in there yeah. somewhere <laughs> like a charlie brown like a charlie brown adult conversation yeah. exactly <laughs> um and so, yeah, he he seems uh, he he seems very impressed by your uh, your grasp of 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 the knowledge of the various you know deities that they uh, pay homage to in the Holy Hands House, and um, you know it it relaxes him a little bit actually. So, um, and then when Virgil places the two gold in his hands, and he's you know he's thinking about like the cost of paper and like the cost of of inks because especially these aren't magical so two gold is is plenty um and he's he clasps it in both of his hands and he says uh certainly certainly we will um where is there do you do you want to what is it i'm trying to say here do you want to be informed when these are distributed uh, I don't think. So. I don't think necessarily. No, I don't think that's necessary. Uh, no, we we certainly we, we certainly have no reason to doubt you, and and we would appreciate the services, and we have other things to. Obviously, based on this, you can tell we have other things to arrange. So there, there's no need. Of course, of and, course, of course, and of course, we hope you know any all some of of the folks here at the Holy Hands uh, will will come by for the event as well. Certainly, certainly. Uh, of of course, uh, this is. I really don't think that we've ever had a town hall before. Um, but yes, I will uh, set the scribes to work on this and uh, thank you very much for your donation. And uh, have a, is there anything else that we can do for you here at the Holy Hands House? Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, we're looking forward to um, working with you to revivify the north I, even as i'm saying it i can't yeah, it's really yeah, yeah it's really yeah it's, it's, yeah, it's, it's, a lot. it's weird it's weird <laughs> well yeah. right. if you want to send a representative to the town hall that might be something good as well excellent uh yeah. well we we will consider that thank you um and he 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 gives you like a very short bow and then like runs off to like deposit the coins and uh <laughs> Oh, oh, I I bow back for sure. Oh yeah, this is my uh, former profession. Leave it alone. <laughs> I, I was like, <laughs> yo, I was so ready to do a role play of the religion too. <laughs> I'll have to, I'll, I'll have to uh, I'll yeah. I'll save that role and then have you and and do yeah. that again at a yeah the, at a later or, yeah, or, yeah. or like it might be some uh some bonus content, but I was definitely going <laughs> to approach it. As a uh, as a five percenter, uh, essentially, uh, oh, boy, breaking down what holy hands actually means, uh, you know, uh, mm -hmm. you know, so very good. We are we are dashing away from the holy hands house that I never. Yeah, have we are. Uh, <laughs> see the word holy, you break it down. Uh -huh. Oh no! Yeah, no. It, was, it was about to be great. It was going to be great. Shaka's no, we need this. We need this. Mm. A, He's about to Shaka's activate. So you like the, yeah. That's right. That's right. <laughs> exactly. I, I just get the laser eyes and everything. <laughs> it was great. Do you, do you get the do you get the koofy hat? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, for sure. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> no, no. Um. <laughs> okay. Well, we can't ever go back there. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Okay. Or we live there now. I don't know which. I mean, it calm. You know, it, it uh calm, calmed our friend down. So you know, it's it worked. It's there true. you go. It's true. It worked. Oh boy! All right. Well, 
<laughs> I don't know anymore. Where do we go? <laughs> So, hey, you know what? Let's take this. Let's take this moment to review what okay, you have yes, done. Yes. You have uh, entreated the Castellanters to help you in any way that they can mm-hmm. uh, through a wonderful breakfast and uh, Salisa's uh, aura of intimidation. Mm-hmm. You mm-hmm. have beseeched the uh, House of Ins. Oh God! You've beseeched the temple. You've beseeched the temple of Gond. Yes. To uh, and, and Zephyr to reach out to uh, people that they may know to you know encourage uh, in- encourage the news to spread. You have drawn up flyers and gone to the uh, All Deities Temple to um, ask them to copy and distribute. Um, and uh, you have spoken to one resident of of the north ward to uh encourage to encourage them to spread the word about your your potential oh. town halls uh, technically two no not two um i knew Ken, Ken was talking to other artists about like Correct. the incubator we, i might have i might have just like followed up with an actual flyer i'd just be like hey if you're talking like just to put it up in the shop but yeah that's probably okay. about it okay yeah so yeah, you have begun to spread the word about your uh, exploits to revivify the North Ward. Mm-hmm. Are you heading back to Troll Skull? I think so. I, think I don't so. know where else yeah. at this point. I mean, I guess we could make a curse. I mean, we could make a trip to the glass blowing guild house if we wanted, but oh, yeah, it would just right. be to put posters up and sort of, you know, spread the word as we've done. I don't know enough about them yet. <laughs> they could just yeah. attend the event, you know. Sure. <clears throat> um, okay, so as you all uh, make your way back to uh, Troll Skull Manor, as you arrive outside the uh, outside the building, there is a cart. A cart, you said? And a cart, yes. And okay. a cart, and there are two people standing outside of the cart. And do we recognize them? You do not. No, are the other five percenters outside. Of the <laughs> Already? Dang, that was fast. No. Oh, was quick. No. That's the real story, like this season. Yeah, is, yeah. Uh, is the a, true I guess, I guess the story. Both the five percenters and water deep, yo, it's going down. <laughs> um, all right, so 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 yeah, it's uh, so yeah. I mean, I guess uh, hi. Hello, hello. You are the rivals, correct? This is. This is Troll Skull. We have a delivery for you. Oh. What is it? From whom? Um, from... So you know the rivals are paranoid. You know if we got packages, we'd be like, ah, toys. <laughs> <laughs> Who gave us something? I mean, it's a cart. Like, what did the... That's yeah. true. That's true. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so the, they, they, they say um, from a, a generous... From, from from a generous benefactor. What might be the castle enters. Okay. Or Mert. Uh, d- we did yell at Mert. <laughs> uh, do, do, do we have to sign anything or? Uh, no, we just need to. It, there's quite a bit on the cart. Who can help us get it? Get it What's, off the cart. What is on the cart? I like go to move the tarp. Yeah. It's it's um several uh several like big old shanks of meat. Yeah, oh, yeah. Food. Okay, okay. Yeah. yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, all right. Yeah. Uh, we understand. Yeah, you can follow me. Uh, I, I like take them back into like near the kitchen because some of this has got to go in cold storage. Um, yeah. Okay. But yeah. All right. So uh, they begin to unload the cart. Uh, uh, cart, cart dude A and cart dude B. Uh, <laughs> they unload the cart. We make carpe diem. And they carpe diem. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> out. Uh, <laughs> goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> Um, and the rest of the day is, is, uh, I'd say it's about, it's about three o'clock at this point, three, four o'clock. Um, what would you, as, as, uh, Gosrick and, uh, cart dudes, uh, unload the, uh, the dragon, the dragon food. And it's, it's a lot. Like you don't think like th- this is, this is meant to be for, for a while. Um, cause you actually have not seen the dragon eat. Yeah, yeah. 
Although honestly, I'm thinking less about that and more about how I'm genuinely surprised that Merck came through. <laughs> yeah, that's that's the most yeah. the most interesting thing here. Yeah. Um, uh, hmm. Oh my god! What? Oh, that's that's sorry, why he. Went I am away. so mad right that's now. Everything that's I kind of love it. Wow, that is, that is really rivalry. Off gotta, to get gotta, a sight gag. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, well, uh, it's called prop comedy, and don't tell Gallagher <laughs> it's not dead. Let me tell you what. <laughs> oh, for our for 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 our podcast listeners, uh, um, uh, Gosrick, Gosrick, yeah, you know what? Yes, Gosrick, yeah, Gosrick walked, comes back with a hat that he Gosrick car- walked off camera and came back with a carpe diem hat. Rap comedy. I'm so sorry that none of you got to see this visual. Have you been planning this joke all season is what I need no, to know. No, honestly, the moment you Several said cart and cart about it, I was like, oh, I have a carpe diem hat. I'll just say it and then I will uh, find an opportunity. You really you really have to seize the day when the opportunity arrives. Right? Yeah. Okay, you now I'm out. You got to take it when you can. No, I'm just now. <laughs> go. no, goodbye. Gotta go. To go. I can't. Like, no, I'm out. Now I will leave again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, Bye. I couldn't. Yeah. I couldn't put something over my camera to be like, I'm done. Is that? Oh. Um. So yes, the the cart dudes and Gazrik begin to unload the cart. Um. Then, uh, it the, the rest of the day is 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 yours. If there is anything else that you can think of or you would like to do, um, um wanting to do something. Day. Uh, Selyse wants to go visit the Temple of Tear, and she actually asked Kent if he'd like to go with her. Uh, Kent is at the mm-hmm. silence. Yeah, no, I, I, yeah, I was just—I <laughs> think out loud in my head. It doesn't matter. Yes, of course, I would love to. Um, yeah, yeah, I would actually. I haven't uh, really only seen the Temple of Gond and now the Holy Hands House. Yeah, I would love to. Thanks for the invite. Um, I guess Fenris will come with us. Does he want to hang out with you all? Does he? He likes Virgil. I mean, I'll watch Fenris if they. I do. You think that I can't? I, I mean, I can't imagine they wouldn't let you. But if you felt it necessary to leave Fenris here, I would certainly <laughs> be fine looking after Fenris. You just want to feed him some meat and hang out and give him scratches, don't you? Not feed, because I don't want him to break training, but. He's oh, a oh, dire wolf. But, what, but a good, what a good trainer. Scritches, yeah. <laughs> and I just, he's, I just, he's very warm to read against, okay? Like, you lean and just very warm. Oh, so that's read. why I can't find him in the morning. He, you've got him snuggled up in bed reading. Yeah, I'm reading. Fenris that's is not adorable. reading. I don't know what this wolf gets up to when I'm not with him. <laughs> yeah, <it. laughs> he's he smart. I don't know. Remember, he tricked us with the Cerebus collar. I don't know. <laughs> um yeah. so I just oh, pat yeah. Fenris. Virgil will watch out. <laughs> Stay with Virgil. Go go to your snuggle buddy. <laughs> uh uh Fenris he barks and and like like runs over to Virgil and like does circles around Virgil and like sits next to sits sits next to him. And shake. uh I told Fenris to shake. And he... oh. is that what you do when what what wait are we are we are we shaking or are we shaking i mean <laughs> it, it could be both yeah then i'm yes. specific. the bestest fenris is the bestest and uh yes all good <laughs> all, right. all right and i just i shimmy turn around. And shake they're two different commands all right uh, so Celise and Kent, you two make your way uh, because we can't take the we can't take the one the the one road. Uh, you've got to go down the um, what's it called the Heroes Way or whatever. Sure. The high road. The high road. Yeah, the high road. Yeah, the high road. Can you take Heroes the low way. road. <laughs> Almost certainly. I am get tired and before. <laughs> Are you? Um, uh past the market to the halls of justice um which is a a large building uh that you can actually as you approach it you can see uh, the blackstaff tower in the distance 
Um, and nearby also is the Temple of Agma, the Font of Knowledge. But um, oh. the Halls of Justice is uh, quiet as both of you enter. Um, uh, similar to any kind of temple that you go in, there are people, um, you know, uh, temple workers, priests, temple workers, goodness, um, who are, you know, going around and like lighting, like lighting candles and, and not necessarily like waving censers. It's not like a, a, a mass church, but, um, you know, again, people in, people in reflection, um, there are tapestries with the symbol of tear, um, hanging on the walls and, um, nobody actually, nobody approaches you all as you enter. Oh, huh. like, um, like there, there are people who acknowledge your presence. Like, you know, they, mm-hmm. they just give you kind of like quiet nods as you enter, but like nobody like walks up to you and says, hi, how are you? My name's right. Ted. <laughs> so this isn't a Baptist church. Right. Correct. <laughs> um, so, uh, I just, I approach, I guess there's like a altar in, in mm-hmm. the front mm-hmm. and uh go down to one knee and respectfully uh bow my head um for a few minutes just kind of communing with tear just um, checking in because i've been i've been a little aggressive with folks just checking in <laughs> <laughs> does tear talk back to me that'd be good uh roll a religion check with advantage i just wanted brian to be tear again <laughs> that was Brian's, awesome. Brian's What's going on? What are we talking about? Okay. That was Brian, an awesome moment. What'd she ask? What's going on? <clears throat> oh, you, said, she, you said religion, religion with advantage? With advantage. Ooh, that is, if I could read my dice. Don't get metal dice when you are bifocal years old. 17. 17? Yeah. Yes. Um, there is a year. So uh, refresh Brian's memory. What are you? What are you? <laughs> Um, so just checking in because you know we we had that rough moment after I killed Raj, and I realized I've been used, I've been more in touch with this barbarian, angry side of me since we got back. <laughs> no, I thought we talked about this, <laughs> Solis. <laughs> Sorry, I that was me laughing, not Solis. Um, but it's for good. You can use anger for good. Are you focusing your anger for a good reason? Or are you just using it to let things out? I mean, the only person I've really been angry at is that Castle Lanner, and you saw what they did to us. No, no, they aren't that. I'm not I'm not going out and like just running down people in the street on a horse or anything. How much of this prayer is out loud, Celise? Oh, uh, it's, you it's know all what? internal. It's just, I, I, I was really want say. Tear to start laughing. I was like, is, is, is her half know, out loud? Right? And, then, and then Tear's half is like in her head. Like, <laughs> you know what? Just let's run with it. Say yes. I forget and start talking out loud. Uh, Kent is Kent is a ways back, you know, respectful at least. But like, here's the thing about the cart. He's like, what? What was the before we arrive? The rivals wild mouth. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> if you uh, wow, <laughs> I'm sorry, the horse. <clears throat> well, I'm sorry, yeah, I brought no. back that Assassin's Creed memory. Yeah, I know. It. <laughs> <laughs> the path is uh, un- the path is a winding one. It is a long one, but Solis, you really have to make sure you are committed to change and redemption. I am, I'm again, it's a I scam. Am. That I'm sounded a little, that sounded a little bit shaky there, Solis, are you sure? No, I, I am sure. If I wasn't sure, I wouldn't have accepted your gifts and I wouldn't have taken the way of the ranger in addition to your path. The, the wolf wouldn't trust me. Animals know people better than people know others. He wouldn't accept my training. He wouldn't stay by my side if I was not using this for good. Then I would say that you are good for now. We'll have to see what happens next. 
I mean, I don't really have any more mortal enemies, so I'm good there. For now. All right. I mean, I mean, I made amends with Siraj's daughter. We're good now. Like you're kind of getting the mental, <laughs> you're getting yeah. the mental impression of like, I I, I have a lot of people to talk to. Like, yeah, like wow, yes, wow, and, yes, dear. and wow, you yeah. off the phone. Like, she I, was like, I gotta go. Nice talking to you. I, yeah, I really seriously, gotta go out, of, now. out of character question: Has Celise ever been to this temple in Waterdeep before? Ah, uh, yeah, it's just not been on screen. Hmm. All right. If it's if it's frequent if it's frequent visit, then it's less it's less an urgency and more of a you you sense that the conversation is coming to its natural end because you're not getting pushback on the things you're saying. Like you're you're confirming that you're good, you're good, and you're not getting any you're not getting any of the, of the sass or the pushback. Sassy tear. Who would have thought? So I'm like, I'm gonna let you go now. I don't want to keep you. <laughs> <laughs> stop. Stop. <laughs> All right, Brian, thank you so much. <laughs> oh, God. Inspiration. <laughs> yes. For sure. Yeah. Mostly because I can't, I don't have a, I don't have a baritone like that. So that would have been, yeah. right? <laughs> but yes, uh, tears, tears, words refresh you. And um, you, 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 you do come to that realization. It's like, where does, where does that energy go now that you don't have, now that you don't have a threat around every corner, like where does that energy yeah. go? It It's there until she comes across someone like her castle lanter mm -hmm. that has done her wrong before. She's not mm -hmm. like the, the anger and the rage is simmering under the surface, but she reserves it for those that deserve it. Mm -hmm. so it's it's very robin hood esque it's not just anything in my way i'm gonna kill it it's like mm -hmm. i got you i remember what you did make me uh make me an insight check as you kind of reflect on that the encounter that you had with the castle enters previously and the encounter that you had uh earlier today make me an insight check okay let's hope my die is not hard to read Ooh, that one was not great. That was only a 10. A 10? Okay. Yeah. Um, you still get the what you all went through when you first. Well, I'm not gonna say first. Um uh, Shaka, that what uh Sharif, that, that was our first encounter with the Castle Lanterns when I, the season I came on. Yes. Okay. So what happened when you all first encountered the Castle Lanterns was um, first off, it was an entire different group of that family and was, you know, influenced not just by them, but by Thavius, you know, like Thavius was kind of like the orchestrator behind all of that to get the manor for, from you all for whatever reason, and to use these people to, um, to stop you from achieving your goals, Highlock, when you um, when you met him uh, two seasons ago, two seasons ago, and this time, has told you that like he's trying to turn over a new leaf with the Castle Lanterns. Like he's the only one right now because he decided that his family, for one reason or another, was irredeemable. <laughs> <laughs> and so um you you come to this realization that as as far as the castle lanterns are concerned at least you are holding on to something that maybe you might need to let go i'll, I'll reflect on that maybe maybe i'll send high a nice fruit basket or something <laughs> Send him some, right. some chicken and a fruit basket. <laughs> but the um, good chicken, wait. the Harold's. Yeah. Necessary. <laughs> yeah. <else. laughs> yes. God. Man. Oh, now I'm hungry. 
<laughs> I'm like, you got a car? It's in the city. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Um, but yes, you like you you come away from your uh your commune with Tyr um a little a, feeling a little better about the path that you were on and with some things to reflect about. Cool. I look around and see where Kent got off to. Um, Kent has been sort of sitting at the back of like the altar space. Um not kneeling, but, you know, sitting quietly, respectfully, could not help but occasionally hearing bits and pieces of Selyse's conversation. is like, wow, tear is just not what I expected, and I sort of love it. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know, I, I, how long were you down there chatting, Selyse? Probably two to five minutes at the most. Oh, yeah, okay. So I, yeah, so I think I just, you know, stayed put, looked around if there are any, you know, particular art pieces or artifacts of tear on display or anything that my little historical archaeological mind might might be interested in you know I might take a it's look at the, that but I don't want to stray too far I feel weird about that <laughs> the architecture in this building is very fine yeah yeah and Salise as you as you stand up and you begin to approach Kent one of the um one of the uh temple clerics or does approach you and says um uh in we we also do have uh private Cloisters, if you would like to, uh, for, for for future, there is no judgment here. Sometimes <laughs> wow. words that decided not true. Am, this is a am house I, of tear. I, am <laughs> I, am I taller than this person? Yes. <laughs> I'm going to stare down at them. It's like, <laughs> are, are you? Do you find a problem with my commune with our with our Lord here? Absolutely not. Uh, you say he, he's this, this person says as they kind of like shrink back a little bit from you. Um, but we know that some of our uh, some of the worshippers of Tear prefer to have louder conversations. And what we, are you trying to say? Be plain. Uh, I just wanted to let you know that if you wanted to have a shouting match with Tear, we have private cloisters where you can do that. I wasn't shouting. No, but you were audible. But that is all I wanted to say, and they back away. Stick to your books. <laughs> is there like a, a head of the of the temple anywhere about? Because Slees wanted to uh, give a donation to the temple. Uh, yeah, there's um, there's another person um, who's uh, they're actually in like uh, scale mail, um, oh, like scale mail with like a. a a tabard over their ma- their mail with the symbol of tear on it, and um, they look a little bit more authoritative. All right, uh, I go up to them and I give them a small bag, well, a small like equivalent of a coin purse with uh, mm-hmm. fifteen gold in it. Fifteen gold in it, sure. Um, he takes it. He uh, he holds it in his hand, and like you know, you see, like he's weighing it in his hand. He says, um, "Your donation is very much appreciated." Go with tear. Go with tear. I don't know. I don't know the right way to say it. Zirin also with Fire. you in there somewhere. I'm like, yeah, what is yeah. that? Also with you. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that's what you were gonna say. That's not where my brain was going, but <laughs> and also with you. <laughs> and and also with you. you. You get the impression that this part, like this person, like whatever somebody said, like whatever they somebody says to them, they just kind of like return that greeting because yeah, everybody yeah, yeah. says something different sure <laughs> uh but, but yeah that that is your experience at the halls of justice oh boy they're they're gonna be like yeah that one just send her right to a room <laughs> <laughs> kent is like nothing about the worship of tear is what i expected not a single so- thing so and is that gonna ask got him your name back. on a list of like yeah yeah. Like, yeah that's just that's a private room that's a private room wow. worthy donation right there yeah wow <laughs> more of a how dare you <laughs> it was like you know Salise is just like if you have questions you can ask me Kat. I mean my real my single question is like is everyone quite so casual I and and that's not a like I love that actually uh, it's just what's that? Uh-huh. Casual? What I mean, you know, you just sort of had it. Uh, now I could only hear one side of it, but it felt like you know, like WeChat. 
And I just, you know, it's tear, Lord of Justice, no? and I sort of expected, you know, I, and, and again, like not judgment. This is just like, if, if many people worship the way that you do, then there are some really fascinating sort of probably like historical inaccuracies about the way we think about, uh, you know, justice, God worship. And I, I just think that's fascinating. I mean, I don't know about everyone else, but you know, I've been pretty casual with tears, so. <laughs> that's amazing, I love it. Uh, yeah, fascinating. Uh, the walk back to Troll Skull is, is uneventful. Um, you do see some of those Aarakocra in the streets who are decrying news. Okay. I feel like I'm using the word, I feel like I'm using the word decrying wrong. No. Sometimes no. when you say the word a lot, it just feels weird. Well, yeah. Right. Yeah. They I mean, think it's the point across, right? Yeah. Yeah. At the very least. Um, all right. Are they screaming about anything interesting? Uh, <laughs> yeah. No. I've never, yeah, I've never wanted to not gather information. Less. <laughs> <laughs> let's scroll um, through what they're. <laughs> no. Give it. Uh, <laughs> no. That, so you're you pass by the market on the way back to the on the way back to the high road, and um, the ones nearby they had they're being they're talking about like market deals because the. The people in the market have like paid them oh, to, okay. to do that and stuff like that. Sure. Yeah, see, we're um, not on latest. We're just on home. We're not on like the latest. So we're getting like the popular information right oh, now. Oh, yeah. I hate this. I hate this. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, once you, you get to the high road. <laughs> 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 <Yeah. laughs> once you get to the high road, uh -huh. it's uh it's it's smooth sailing back to back to Troll Skull. And um, I think. I think that that's where we're going to call it. Um, yeah. It was a very productive day. Oh, it was. Yeah. Very, we're just very good. Cool. Um, so before we go into questions and outros, I would like, let's see, I would like everybody to roll me a percentile. Oh. Oh. Really? Um, that's like just a D100? Mm -hmm. yeah. A D100, yeah. D100. Hey. Yeah. 29? That makes sense. Uh, Kent got a 77. <clears throat> Virgil has 63. a 79. Mm -hmm. 63. Yep, Salise is upon her return. Mm -hmm. Oh, Dahani and Gosrick matching up nicely. But yeah. what? Weird. Right. What? It's, one, and then, uh, what? it's one in a hundred times one in a, one in a million chance. Is that it? Yeah. One in 10,000. One in 10,000. Thank you. Mm -hmm. My magnitude's of 10. <laughs> <laughs> Four zeros. Four zeros, right. Just count the zeros. Oh, did I do it wrong? No, no, no you're right. No, you, you, yeah, right. Yeah, you got it. Yeah. I threw it in. Uh, so, Luis, will you do me a favor and uh, roll me a percentile? Uh, sure. Yeah. We, uh, we, we called the session with you all, uh, with you and Kent walking back to Troll Skull. Okay. Uh, but while Celise rolls that percentile, it is time for Rivals questions, everybody. Yeah. 57. Yeah. 57. Okay. Excellent. Um, so as per usual, at the end of the show, we take questions directed at the characters, not at, uh, at the people. Um, so if you have any questions, please, please, please preface them with the word question in all caps. <laughs> um, and while we get those questions in, we're going to go. Yeah, no, yeah, I'm not. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, so uh, we're going to go around in reverse order and tell everybody who we are, what we got going on, and where you can find us, starting with Masood, who's that one. Hello, I'm Masood. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter at Maroodboy, M-A-H-R-U-D-E-B-O-I. Um, I'm going to be uh, not streaming this week because uh, I'm not going to be home. I'm not going to be around the PC. I'm going to be uh, in LA for a wedding and networking with people. I am meeting up with friends in LA before a wedding. That's Let's just call it what it is. <laughs> Uh, but I will be around next Sunday uh, streaming from the road. So you get to see me in the lovely West Coast. I'm, I'll feel, I'll do it outside if I can. I'll do it. I'll have even more sunlight than Eugenio. And that's a challenge. Uh, and 
<laughs> yeah, but that'll just be me. Uh, if you want to catch up more what I'm up to, you can find me on uh, Twitter and Instagram at Rude Boy. Um, but yeah. Hey, Hi, I'm Eugenio. I'm doing jazzy hands. I'm being attacked by the sun. Uh, actually, much like uh, Masood, uh, I don't have a ton going on for the next several weeks, except for Rivals. Um, I'm actually, uh, the reason that the sun is attacking me today is that I'm all packed up with all of my gear. Uh, so I didn't have my light today to stream, uh, but I'm, I'm going back to the theater. I'm super excited. I've been asked to come in and music direct a new production of In the Heights in Virginia. Uh, and I leave tomorrow morning. So I will still be around uh, every Sunday, except for one, I will be missing one episode. I'll still be around on Sundays for Rivals, uh, but I will not be streaming on my channel. I won't be able to really do a ton of other extra events for the duration of the run. But I'm super excited to get back to that and still be able to be here on Sundays with you all. Um, so in the meantime, uh, you know, if stuff does come up, you can follow me on the Twitters at DM Jazzy Hens. Uh, but yeah, that's me for now. Hey, take it away, Brian. Uh, sure. Uh, let's see. Uh, you can find me everywhere at Urban Bohemian. Uh, Twitter is the best way to keep up with what's going on. Tomorrow evening, I will be over at twitch.tv slash wireless riot at about 5 p.m. Eastern. We will be doing a kitchen stream. Uh, it is pie day, so all of our dishes are going to have the theme of pie in some way or another. On Tuesday, I will be doing a sponsored stream for a game called Harlow, uh, which is sort of like a... Um, puzzle platformer, and uh, it was developed by a cancer survivor who basically started turning to art uh, to create and help get through uh, dealing with dealing with a chronic illness and dealing with a lot of other things in life. And then Saturday, I'll be playing something, I don't know, maybe Space Destiny, because I haven't gotten back to it in a while. And then yes, you will find me here next Sunday with uh, the rivals, continuing to rival as we are rivaling something. Every day I'm rifling. <laughs> no, I'm not going to dance because it's going to be a gif again. No. <laughs> uh, uh, it's it's already happening. I, I can sense it. I can sense it. Uh, Sharif. Hey, everybody. Uh, you can find me at SharifJackson.com. S-H-A-R-E-E-F Jackson.com. Uh, and Sharif Jackson on all social networks. Um, as I said during the ad read, uh, we have two more episodes left of uh, Idol Champions presents Court of the Raven Queen um, at twitch.tv slash CNE Games. Um, and that's at uh, Mondays, 4 p.m. Pacific, 7 p.m. Eastern. Um, we do have some other special guests coming up, but it's DM by uh, B. Dave Walters and features a bunch of us. And it's very, very fun. Um, so, so like, make sure to like uh, check out the final two episodes of that, as well as um, the, uh, the, uh, the, uh, the uh, campaign right before this about Tiamat is like also on their YouTube channel archives. Make sure to check that out as well. Um, other than that, uh, I'm just uh, grading a lot of papers because uh, it's in the midst of the college semester and there's many papers to grade. So that's a lot of fun uh, and playing way too much destiny as well. Uh, oh, and raising a child. Uh, oh, that's, that's also oh, that thing. That's, yeah. 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 And, and that. <laughs> That that baby has some very interesting opinions. Love it. Yeah. Yes. Uh, Tanya, you are muted. I software and hardware muted. Go me. Um, I'm actually going to be gone too. I think we all are just hitting the road this week. If you're in Austin, Texas, um, I will be at South by Southwest on a panel Tuesday called uh, Game Changer: Black and Indigenous Voices with Latoya Peterson, uh, Eric Lawyer, and Paisley Smith. If you're not there, I don't know if it's being recorded or streamed. I will probably find out when I get there. If it is, great, I'll have a video. If not, oh well, you had to be there. Um, and then when I get back is Thursday, Black Dice Society, things are getting things are getting real interesting. We ran into Desmond's brother, but DJ's not there this week, so I don't know what's gonna happen there. And, uh, yeah, doing a panel also on Friday, New York Women in Film and Technology. That is Friday night, 4 p.m. Eastern. So I'm doing many things, just not on my channel. So find me on the Twitters. I'll be tweeting about all the stuff. Uh, and I have been your Dungeon Master, Latia Jaquise. You can find me everywhere at Latia Jaquise. I am also traveling. If you are going to be in Reno, I will be at Gamma Trade Show. I don't know. Um, and I also have been like seriously neglecting to say this, but 
I have a book coming out on Tuesday. <laughs> Whoa! I'm sorry, what? Whoa! I, 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 what? I'm, I really thought I, I knew you, and now I feel <laughs> feel 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 really not bad. I feel like such a yeah, bad thing. I, wow, I wrote Gia. A, I, I'm te- I'm terrible. I'm terrible. I'm okay. so terrible. Uh, I was one of the writing team on a little book called Critical Role Call of the Netherdeep. Uh, that's releasing on Tuesday. So um, I, you can celebrate that with me. I don't know what, I mean, I can't, I can't do anything because I'll be on a work trip, but uh, I'll be looking at everybody on Twitter talking about it. So get the book. Let me know how you love it. Um, It's, I'm so excited to finally have it out in the world. um, And for people I've seen, I saw my name in the credits and it was just like, ah! Um, So it's the best. Did 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 you write like a specific module or or like just so generally the, like contributed to a bunch of stuff? It is it's a full length adventure, and I wrote the first two chapters. Oh like wow! Two two chapters of the adventure. I wrote the first two chapters. Sweet. So, um, Easing them to, in. What's yeah. To you. I like that. Exactly. Um, leaning on my my love of of. Well, I can't really talk about it yet, but yeah. I'll I'll tell I'll tell everybody, I'll tell everybody everything uh, after Tuesday. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Yes, get get the book. Um, it's so pre-ordered. That's, I ordered it. Yay! So that's my surprising news. I'm ter- I'm so terrible. <laughs> uh, but it's two o'clock, so let's run through these questions really quickly. Um, like I said, find me on Twitter because I'm going to be out of town. I'll be in Reno all week. If you're at Gamma Trade Show, come by uh, the Monty Cook Games booth. That's where I'll be. Stuff like that. Um, so questions, uh, question for Tier. How is your usual day answering to the prayers of your followers? Are they all so loud and so fun? No, they are not. <laughs> Mostly I try to go for the vague ethereal expectation answer, but honestly, uh, there's a reason that Waterdeep offers private cloisters. Uh, Water Davians are, they're, they're pretty loud. A uh, question for Duo, uh, which is also partially a question for Gosric. Did Duo figure out his five-year plan? Well, we had uh, some conversations with like any sort of the moment. Today was just about gestation of ideas. We're going to come back, talk about long-term structures, really sort of connect the dots in between the goalposts that we set up for ourselves. And we're going to see some real improvement in these upcoming five years. It's going to be a great fiscal cycle. Uh, yeah, mostly, mostly <laughs> guys like just mostly God just talked about me about all that stuff. And I just figured, I mean, I'm a ghost. It's not really a whole lot that I can do for five. I mean, I'm basically bound to the mana. So he's going to be here for the next five years. And then we're just going to see what com- comes out after that. I don't, I'm not sure. <laughs> all right, buddy. Classic. Uh, but- do you mean the duo just never does duo not think that, that he can leave the manor? No, I don't think he does, but <laughs> oh my gosh, he's actually agoraphobic. Actually, <laughs> oh, oh, is agoraphobic. have we finally figured it out? Oh, For real, Wait, it we, he, he came he came from somewhere that was not the manor, and oh, right, yeah, 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 yeah he, he's so, a yeah. oh my gosh, that's amazing. <laughs> He, he 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 leaves it, but he thinks that it's just like he's only allowed to leave it to do what he does, and then he comes back. Um, you know? um, oh my god! And then, final question for Kent: Has have your various visits to the temples lately caused you to become interested in potentially communing or following a deity of some sort, or are you more interested in the historical aspects? I mean, on the whole, definitely the historical aspects, but this is a little bit out of character. What fascinates both me and Kent about religion in D&D is that there is like undeniable evidence of the existence of the gods, right? So it isn't about belief in them, right? It's about like actively choosing to worship them. And generally Kent does not make that choice. Um, Respects them for sure. But having spent a large chunk of his adult life as an archeologist who was often delving old religious sites dedicated to various gods, good, evil, and otherwise, uh, there is a healthy respect for their power and very little desire to be a uh, a worshiper thereof. Gotcha, gotcha. That makes a lot of sense. Um, so that was our episode. Um, I just want to say before we before we 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 sign off, I just want to say that it's very interesting to see Epenio getting the sun, the yeah. sun consequences this week. 
uh, this week and this season because it used to be me with my lens flares, if Mm -hmm. you remember. Uh So it's nice to have somebody else kind of dealing with what I was dealing with. But uh, we are going to raid Kelly, the the opera geek. She is uh, live and raising money for Stop MS. Thank you all so much for watching and uh, being here with us. We're going to see you next week. Uh, for episode seven, when uh, we're going to, I'm going to tell you now, we're going to do a little bit of a time skip. This week's going to go by really quickly. And then we're going to get right to the town hall. Just yeah. cool that you know that. So uh, see you all next oh. week. Uh, stick around. We're going to Ray Kelly and have a wonderful week, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye, y'all.